And welcome back. This is the final hour of uh, the agenda. Let's quickly take you to Inanda in KwaZulu Natal, where President Cyril Ramaphosa has officially opened the Dr. Pixlika Isaka Memorial um, Hospital. Um, the ceremony is currently underway. Our reporter Jade Polser is there as well. Well, as you can see on your screens right now, the president of the country, Sol Ramaphosa, flanked by dignitaries as well as political heavyweights, uh, the premier, Dr. Mzweli Mkize, and also family members of the person that the hospital is named of, Dr. Pixley Kaisa Kaseme, who was one of the founders of the African from Inanda. Now they have just officially the placard they will be now showcasing the new stand will be here at the Memorial Hospital and they after cutting of the ribbon. Reading out for signature of the hospital. Let's do it. <laughs> this hospital has been in operational for two years now, but officially opened, will be open today once President Sol Ramaphosa cuts that ribbon. 500 bed facility providing round the clock services that will include pediatrics, gynecology, general surgery, mental health, and radiology. And will serve more than 1.5 million community members in the pink area, such as Phoenix, Inandan Tuzuma, and Kwamashi. A first world class facility here in Kwamashi. So from here, once the picture ceremony has taken place with some of the dignitaries, including the Premier of the province, Nomusa Dubenube, the family members that you're seeing on your screen right now in front of the statue, they will then move over to the ribbon ceremony. If you can just stay on our visuals as we, as the media are moving to the ribbon cutting ceremony. this is 
so special is, you know, just speaking to the CEO this morning of the hospital, Jamim Tetwa, citing that majority of the healthcare workers at the Dr. Pixlika Isa Kaseme Hospital are from the area. They hail from Nduzuma, they hail from Inanda and Kwamash and Phoenix. And many of them have also gotten a lifeline. Many of them have got jobs here and will be working in this new facility. We've also spoken to healthcare practitioners at the hospital. We've spoken to patients who are very grateful to have the state of the art facility here in Kwamashu providing round the clock services. Patients will have access to the burn unit, to a high care unit, an intensive care unit, trauma and emergency services. And the hospital will also receive referrals from, from district hospitals, as we can see the president making his way, waving to the healthcare workers here who are jubilant as a first citizen of the country will officially open up the facility. As we try and get a bit closer. We don't want to take pictures of the body cards, man. We want the Oh, well, live visuals there coming out of uh, Guamashu, where we've just seen the official opening of Pixlika Isaga Seme um, Memorial Hospital and uh, the president unveiling the plague as well as uh, the statue of one of the co-founders of the ANC, Pixlika Isaka Seme. I was just saying to the team now, it's interesting also to see um, there that you have the Premier Nomusa Tube Mnube not being flanked by the Economic Development um, MEC's Bonis Otumo. The 2.7 billion rand hospital has a bed capacity of 500. Healthcare services include gynecology, psychiatry and mental health. The hospital CEO is Dr. Jimmy Mtetwa.